Hey everyone, my name is Molly, a Dick Sporting Goods teammate, and today we're going to break down how to properly set up your exercise bike. Adjusting your exercise bike can do a lot more than increase your cardio comfort. Understanding how to set up your exercise bike can help you get the most out of each workout while also maximizing comfort. Use these quick tips to make the right moves with your training equipment before your next ride. First, adjust your seat height. Stand to the side of your exercise bike and raise or lower the saddle to hip level. You can also raise your knee to 90 degrees and align the saddle with the center of your thigh. To check your seat height, hop in the saddle and place your pedal at its lowest level. If you think of the pedal as a clock, this position would be six o'clock. Your saddle is at the correct height if there is a slight bend in your knee at this position. Next, determine your saddle's horizontal setting. For the best setup, remain seated and move your pedal to the front or three o'clock position. You should be able to draw a straight line from your knee down to the tip of your toes. Adjust your seat forward or backward accordingly to achieve this line. After your saddle is set, take a look at your handlebars. You'll want your spine in a neutral position, no arch or curve, along with a slight bend in your elbows as your hands rest on the grips. Raise or lower your handlebars until these criteria are met. Do a once over to ensure everything is locked in place. For recumbent exercise bikes, make sure you aren't overstretching your strokes. Place your foot at the three o'clock position and adjust your seat forward or backward so that there is a slight bend in your knee. If you're unsure if you're overstretching, pay attention to your stroke cycle as you pedal a few times. The right adjustments can help make your workouts more comfortable and effective. Find success in the saddle with these exercise bike pro tips.